Hello, thank you for being with me here at Back to One with Brandy. Today is January 3rd, 2020. Happy New Year, if I haven't already got to tell you. So today we have some affirmations and some heart and soul insight. <clears throat> okay, so our first affirmation is don't take it personally. Okay, so don't don't take it personally. And then our second one is beauty. We can see these. There we go. Go ahead and pause and read that to yourself or screenshot them. Okay, with um, don't take it personally, we have overcoming adversity. Okay, so that did not happen by chance. Okay, so adversity is uh, the roadblock in life path. It's a boss that never gives a compliment. It's the house that can't be fixed, a jealous family member. Instead of viewing these things as obstacles, look at them as building blocks for your personal growth, okay? Remember, don't take it personally. And understand greed. You know, maybe that will help you. Greed is evil in itself, and it's a terrible addiction. It's an empty dream, as material items are only ours for a very brief time. Don't let what you rule, or don't let what you have rule you. Keep, don't keep and give away, they're even saying. So maybe purge a little bit. Um, move the stagnant energy, even. Um... Dealing with depression, okay? So, um, depression is exactly what it sounds like. It pushes you down and makes you immobile. When you set yourself outside the, when you set sights outside of yourself you and begin to help others, your depression turns into expression. The expression of God's goodness through you. And that makes total sense of to why they, um, Bless us with the beauty affirmation. Wow, you guys, these are amazing cards together. Um, I'm going to go ahead and shuffle and see what kind of collective message we can get from this beautiful deck. Also have healing, Reiki healing playing in the background. So um, be open to receiving the Reiki that you hear. This is one of my favorite tracks. Okay, our overall energy for the collective effect one. Wow, the the <laughs> this is success. This is passion. This is creativity. The Ace of Wands. This is a beautiful new beginning of passion. Even look at the six of six of Wands at the bottom of the deck. You you're on your way to success. Let's see what the top card is. Okay, so bid your time, self discipline, um, gather your resources. Follow the commands of your heart. This is this is a Knight of Cups. This is a Scorpio card also. Um, because you're on your way to success, the Four of Swords, or Four of Wands, you're almost there. Wow, so three cards talking about success. Okay, so the Four of Cups. So um, make sure they're not petty desires and make sure you're not in isolation. These are amazing cards, you guys. Thank you so much for being here with me. Um, I will probably be doing a live here after a bit for Friday's energy. So I can't wait to see you guys on Facebook. Thank you so much for being here. Bye.